So let's take a closer look at the contributions of bile from the liver stored in the gallbladder and pancreatic enzymes towards digestion. So first of all, as we know, bile is made in the liver and is stored in the gallbladder. This lies on the undersurface of the liver here. In the gallbladder, bile is concentrated and is then released into the bile duct when it's needed to go to the small intestine. It travels down the bile duct into the duodenum. Now this part of the duodenum is receiving food from the stomach and sending it to the rest of the small intestine. Now, the pancreas has two functions. Firstly, it produces pancreatic enzymes. These are fed into a main pancreatic duct, join onto the bile duct, and are also fed into the small intestine. These are responsible for breakdown of carbohydrates, proteins, and lipids. The pancreas also produces hormones. These are insulin and glucagon, and are involved in the control of blood glucose levels. They're released directly into the bloodstream from the pancreas.